Hi, I'm Nick with WatchGuard Technologies. Today I'm going to walk you through the quick and straightforward process of configuring a secure guest Wi-Fi hotspot using a WatchGuard wireless appliance. Since the WatchGuard firewall completely separates guests from your own internal office network traffic, customers and visitors can surf Wi-Fi securely while your own internal network remains private and protected from any infections that might exist on their systems. Today we'll use the WatchGuard System Manager interface to configure a guest wireless network, but you can also use the web UI. Let's go to the XDM Policy Manager now. So here we are at the Policy Manager using the WSM interface. We're going to start by clicking on Network, then Wireless. We're presented with the option of enabling wireless as well as the ability to set radio settings such as bands, wireless mode, and channels. We'll enable wireless access points and then enable the wireless guest network by clicking on the configure button next to wireless guest. This opens the wireless guest configuration window. Here we select enable wireless guest network which activates a series of tabs on top of the window. Now we need to assign an IP address and subnet mask for your network. The WatchGuard appliance is capable of acting as a DHCP server on your wireless guest network. If you want, you can set up DHCP reservations by MAC address. You can define DHCP lease durations. You may enter IP addresses for both WINS and DNS servers as well as your domain name. Next, we click on the Wireless tab. You can name the broadcast SSID. In this case, we've named it Coffee. You can also log authentication events and enable the blocking of client-to-client -client wireless connections on the guest network, and you can set fragmentation thresholds. For encryption authentication, choose your preference using a simple drop-down menu. You can also select an encryption algorithm and create the passphrase you want your wireless guests to use when they authenticate to the guest wireless network. The next tab is for MAC access control, which you can use if you want to restrict access to the guest network using MAC addresses. As you see here, the last tab is the hotspot tab. Enabling the hotspot allows us to define session and idle timeouts as well as to configure the splash page. This is where your guests will be guided when they log on. You can also customize the splash page by adding a page title, a custom message, and even a custom logo, such as your company logo. Enter any text for terms and conditions you want your wireless guests to adhere to when they're on the guest network. After your guests successfully authenticate, you'll have the ability to direct them to a specific URL or just release them out to the web. Clicking the Preview Splash Screen button allows you to review what your wireless guests will see when they log on. They must acknowledge your terms and conditions by clicking the box after which they're able to go out to the web. Save this to your WatchGuard firewall, and you're done. Any policy restrictions that you want to establish for the guest network can be set up in Policy Manager. And that's how easy it is to set up a secure Wi-Fi hotspot using WatchGuard that completely secures your guest traffic from your internal network. If you have any further questions about this, please check out some of our online resources or contact technical support. Thanks for listening.